Summatizing is a fun word that simply means recognizing quantities instantly. For example, if you saw this set, you would know that it's five, rather than having to count one, two, three, four, five. Summatizing helps students build a deep concept of number and have a deep understanding of what numbers are. There are many ways we practice subitizing at school, and you can practice these at home. We use five frames where there's simply five boxes, and students always want to remind them to start at the left and fill it in as you go to the right. There's also ten frames and double ten frames. When practicing and working with numbers, we start with smaller numbers and work toward larger numbers. And furthermore, we start with familiar patterns and then work toward less familiar patterns. When talking with unfamiliar patterns or familiar patterns, we not only want the students to recognize the quantity and say the quantity, but we want them to explain how they see the number. So for example, students might say that they see 3 and 3 and they know that that is 6. Another way you can work with subitizing is using dominoes. And students can recognize quantities instantly and realize that that's six. A fun way to do this at home is to use paper plates. You can simply draw dots on plates or you can use dot stickers and show different sets and practice these with your children. Another tool that we use at school is the Rec and Rec. We have a video about the Rec and Rec if you want more information. And the Rec and Rec simply has 10 beads on top and 10 beads on bottom. And if this were over on this side, students would realize that there's five green and two yellow. So they would know that that's seven. Sympathizing, again, is a very powerful skill for your child and will greatly help them as they continue as mathematicians. Thanks for working with your child and supporting them at home.